There is no freedom of speech in Nigeria. AY. Ace comedian AY has received major backlash for his tweet that was a response to the Funka Kindele saga where he asked Nigerians to channel the same energy being used to drag the actress on the government. His tweet read, Yes, nobody's above the law, but I wish those of you who called out at Funka Kindele can do same with your countless oppressors in government. Even when the sky is filled with clouds, the sun still shines above. Funke will rise again. Hashtag lessons learned. In an exclusive interview with our correspondent, he bared his mind and how the reaction Actions from Nigerians made him feel, and he also used this medium to respond to Nigerians who accused him of not using his platforms to address the issues in Nigeria and the government. There was a particular tweet that brought about the virus spin. So a part of me needed to also correct it because the guy claimed that I have never ever used my platform hmm. to advocate, you know, things that concerns, you know, uh government the people and and what have you so and that that and that was a lie because people who know who know me so well they they will know that i have used my platform over time whether it's politics whether it's true sarcasm whether it's true satire and all that i've used my platform over time to do all of that and i've also used my platform to correct a lot of things that are not going well Imagine when we needed to bring our people back from South Africa. That was me crying on my platform, uh, uh, platforms across board. I have my social media space is about 40 million followers. If you put them together, I use my platform to, to advocate and, and talk about it. And then when the whole um, uh, uh, Libya thing was going on, I used my platform. So when somebody would just wake up and just type, for somebody who has never used his platform, that's a lie. And then everybody started following on the thread. You would believe, you would see that everybody believed the person because mm -hmm. the person was making the point. So sometimes uh, when you want to lash somebody, when you want to say the truth, say it the way it is, and even went ahead to, to uh, insult my craft, saying that, okay, it's because the politicians are the ones buying your tables and all of that. That's why you wouldn't attack them. And so many of these people, they don't even know what and what we have been through. AY revealed what he's been up to in this lockdown and how this period has helped him bond better with his family. I agree with you, AY. I agree with you. But let's talk about you personally. How has your lockdown experience been for you, for AY? Yeah, it's been, it's been okay. It's been okay. Uh, many a times I... I just feel like uh, maybe I should just go out somewhere and uh, stretch my legs. You know, I love to play football when I'm not working. And all of that hasn't uh, happened in the last few days. But more importantly, the lockdown has formed a major uh, bonding spirit for, for the family. You know, because of the nature of our job, we're always away. Always away and uh, doing what we do know how to do best. But this is a good time to bond with, with family. And my daughter and I have been engaging ourselves, doing a lot of skits. There are some pretty good new things that I'm learning from her as well. So, uh, what the lockdown has done is to create that extra bond and uh, family unity. Uh, it's, it's been good so far for me. It's, it's just okay. But all the same, you know, those of us who usually would love to work, who are workaholics, who, who want to find that thing that takes us out and, of course, you know, put uh, uh, food on the table. AY Live, Easter Sunday, set to take center stage. AY Live, Easter Sunday, one of the biggest comedy shows in Africa is set to hold on Easter Sunday via all social media platforms and will be televised live on Hip TV. When asked what informed his decision to still host the annual event via social media, he had this to say. Okay, now, the truth is that innovation is one thing that... Uh, makes a brand stand out. Uh, you must always uh, think out of the box and uh, come out with uh, different creative uh, ideas that would still make your brand uh, stay afloat, stand out, 
and what have you. Now, yes, Easter Sunday is a traditional date for everybody. So, uh, uh, in as much as AY Live is concerned, for majority of people. So, it will be wrong to just let that Easter pass and then look like you, you just you, you put off a bulb concerning the brand on that day. And when you, when you can, uh, you know, let people know that the light is still on. And meanwhile, you're postponing your show. You're going to do the show sometime again in this year. But then you just want people to have that sense of attachment to the brand on Easter Sunday. So that when they think of it, well, like they still remember Easter Sunday. And so that informed the decision to come up with something. And uh, uh, going live online is one one very good pattern uh, to, to achieve it. So I, I made that decision, uh, you know, uh, ran it by a couple of my, my guys and everything. And it was something that uh, was highly supported by a lot of people who, uh, Michael Paris, uh, Mr. Ayo, and Imashao as well, uh, we talked about it and we said it would be nice. Why, instead of you just doing it live on, uh, Instagram. So, Mr. Ayan, so when, when we had that chat, it was also necessary to do it live on TV. Yeah. Some people will probably won't uh, uh, have money to get data. data who also yeah. have, uh, who also probably have subscription running in their homes uh, to sure. see it on TV. He concluded this interview by urging Nigerians to foster unity as it will help in getting through this period. Well, I know that the frustration level is top notch for almost all of us, hmm. and that's why you know, you know Nigerians once uh, once the frustration hits uh, the different uh, people or different people, they look for who to just put everything uh, on his or her head. But let me tell you the truth: uh, we are all in this together. Please. The time that we use in fighting each other concerning this pandemic or concerning the situation that everybody is facing one way or the other, the time we use in, in fighting each other, let's use that time uh, to, to, to come together, have that constructive argument, also have a reason you know, to believe that this weeping will endure for a while and joy will definitely come in the morning time. So please, guys. Uh, stay at home. Don't go nowhere. The only way we can control this uh, uh, global uh, issue that is affecting each and every one of us is to stay at home, is to uh, obey the laws of the land and do what we have to do. And for those of you who don't have uh, food or something, please look for ways to make your problems known to those who also can be of help. Yes, they're not a use shame. Say sharp point. Just say it the way it is and God willing, you would get help this period because it's difficult for, for a lot of families and I know God would definitely see us through. Thank you very much. AY Live on Easter Sunday, special live edition featuring performances from comedians and online giveaways to cushion the lockdown effects. Tune in live to Heap TV, AY Comedian on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube channel. Time, 7 p.m. Powered by Heap TV, Coleman Wise, and Revolution Plus Properties. I look you